The Dimension Map or Fuller Map is a projection of a world map onto the surface of an icosahedron, which can be unfolded and flattened to two dimensions. The flat map is heavily interrupted in order to preserve shapes and sizes. The map was created by Buckminster Fuller. The March 1, 1943, edition of Life magazine included a photographic essay titled Life Presents a Buckminster Fuller's Dimension World. The article included several examples of its use together with a pull-out section that could be assembled as a three-dimensional approximation of a globe or laid out as a flat map, with which the world may be fitted together and rearranged to illuminate special aspects of its geography. Fuller applied for a patent in the United States in February 1944, the patent application showing a projection onto a cuboctahedron. The patent was issued in January 1946. The 1954 version published by Fuller, the Eroshian world map, used a modified but mostly regular icosahedron as the base for the projection, which is the version most commonly referred to today. This version depicts the Earth's continents as one island, or nearly contiguous land masses. The Dimiction projection is intended only for representations of the entire globe. It is not a gnomonic projection whereby global data expands from the center point of a tangent facet outward to the edges. Instead, each triangle edge of the Dimiction map matches the scale of a partial great circle on a corresponding globe, and other points within each facet shrink toward its middle, rather than enlarging to the peripheries. The name Dimiction was applied by Fuller to several of his inventions. Properties, Fuller claimed that his map had several advantages over other projections for world maps. It has less distortion of relative size of areas, most notably when compared to the Mercator projection. And less distortion of shapes of areas, notably when compared to the Gala Euro Peters projection. Other compromise projections attempt a similar trade off. More unusually, the Dimiction map does not have any right way up. Fuller argued that in the universe there is no up, and down, or north, and south only in, and out. Gravitational forces of the stars and planets created in, meaning towards the gravitational center, and out, meaning away from the gravitational center. He attributed the north up superior south down inferior presentation of most other world maps to cultural bias. Fuller intended the map to be unfolded in different ways to emphasize different aspects of the world. Peeling the triangular faces of the icosahedron apart in one way results in an icosahedral net that shows an almost contiguous land mass comprising all of Earth's continents a year are not groups of continents divided by oceans. Peeling the solid apart in a different way presents a view of the world dominated by connected oceans surrounded by land. Showing the continents as one island Earth also helped Fuller explain, in his book Critical Path, the journeys of early seafaring people who were in effect using prevailing winds to circumnavigate this world island. Impact, a 1967 Jasper Johns painting, map, depicting a Dimiction map, hangs in the permanent collection of the Museum Ludwig in Cologne. The World Game, a collaborative simulation game in which players attempt to solve world problems, is played on a 70 by 35 foot Dimiction map. In 2013, to commemorate the 70th anniversary of the publication of the Dimiction Map in Life magazine, the Buckminster Fuller Institute announced the Dimax Redo, a competition for graphic designers and visual artists to reimagine the Dimiction Map. The competition received over 300 entries from 42 countries. See also List of map projections References External links DYMAX or EDUX a design competition for a fresh take on the Dimiction projection by the Buckminster Fuller Institute, Fuller Map Homepage, Dimiction Project Animation, Icosahedron and Fuller Maps, dynamically generated maps based on the Dimiction projection.